guys? Are your Pathfinders begging to do the drawing honor, yet you're not very artistic and you don't know too much about drawing? Well, never fear. Today I'm going to show you some tips and tricks on how to teach the drawing honor using online resources. It'll be painless, you're going to love it. So stick with me for a few minutes and I'll let you in on the secret. The first thing we want to do to get started is go to pathfinderstrong.weebly.com and this is the first page you'll see. You want to click on the Honor tab and scroll down to Drawing Honor. Here you'll see that there is a list of seven online tasks that the Pathfinders are going to complete for this honor. Task one is to make a drawing media glossary. If you click the green links for each one of these tasks, a separate page or video or item will open up to help them. In this case, when we click the link, a list of drawing media glossary terms are going to open up and the Pathfinders are going to pick 10 of these and they're going to write them and their definitions in their drawing notebook. Task number two is to draw a value scale. And if you click the link for this one, it is going to open up a YouTube video for how to draw a value scale. So this is a video by Mr. Otter, Mr. Otter Art Studio, and it's Beginner's Drawing Shading Part 1, and they literally walk you through step-by-step step on how to draw this value scale here. And it's like a three-minute video. It's very simple and easy to follow. Once the Pathfinders finish the video, then they'll want to draw a value scale of their own in their drawing notebook. The third task is to draw a sphere using your value scale. So using that value scale they just made, they're going to draw a sphere. And once again, there is a video for this. This happens to be the video part two of the one that we just watched. And using the value scale that the Pathfinders just drew, um, the teacher is going to walk um, you through step by step on how to draw a sphere. So they'll watch that three minute video and then they'll draw a sphere in their own drawing notebook. The fourth task is on subject matter, and this is a little bit different of a task. You're going to need to print out some documents ahead of time and have them ready for the Pathfinder. So click here and we'll open a Google Doc folder to this file, and when we open that file, this will pull up. You'll want to print these out and have these charts available to be cut out and glued into the Pathfinder's drawing notebook. What they're going to do is sort eight pictures into the correct category. So they're learning the difference between portraits, landscapes, still lifes, and abstracts. And if you scroll down a little bit, there are the eight different pictures here. And they'll want to cut these out and glue them into the correct category. So for example, this first one, this is a portrait. This one is a still life. This one is a portrait. This one is an abstract, and so on and so forth. So they'll want to cut those out individually and glue them into these categories, and this chart will be glued into their drawing notebook. Task number five is to draw a landscape in one-point perspective. So when we quit, click this link, a YouTube video will pop up. This is a really nice video. It's by Circle Line Art School, and this gentleman um, shows Pathfinders how to draw in single point perspective and they literally are walked through it step by step. So you start by drawing a line, draw your perspective point, and then um, you just kind of add to that as you go and it ends up being a really cool picture. So that's what you get in the end. And even though that looks pretty cool and um, kind of difficult to do, if you follow these step by step instructions, anybody Pretty much anybody can draw this and it will turn out looking just like this. So this is a great video to teach perspective. The sixth task is picture space. So Pathfinders are going to be learning about the different spaces in an image. So there are two different image links to click on and when you open them up you will see this is the first one. It shows you the difference between the background, the midground, and the foreground. And then here's another one, a little more simpler, the background, the middle ground, and the foreground. And the Pathfinders are going to draw a similar model of this into their drawing notebook. So they'll literally be kind of copying this and drawing into their notebook to help learn about the different ground spaces. Lastly, the seventh task is um, to read about um, drawing and how it relates to the Bible. And so this is a link for Proverbs 33.6. So this link opens up to Bible Gateway, where you'll see this verse where the Pathfinders will read it, write it down in their notebook, and then write a couple sentences about what this verse has to do with the drawing honor. Now to finish this honor, 
um, you have to do just some drawings of different items. And in this case, I highly recommend um, a drawing resource that I ran across, and this is a video about that resource. It's called Strathmore Learn to Draw Cartoons. And they also, Strathmore also puts out a book called Learn to Draw Animals, where that book is all about animals. I highly recommend this book. Um, please watch the video as soon as you're done with this and uh, find out all about that resource. You can pick up this book on Amazon. I got it from my Pathfinders and they loved it. And there you have it, the drawing honor in a nutshell. Pretty pain free, even if you don't know anything about drawing. Just use those online resources. You're gonna need a laptop or a tablet for your Pathfinders and a reliable internet um, connection or a hotspot of some kind. I did mention that drawing book. Um, I actually have one here. Here's what it looks like. It's nice spiral bound, has a chipboard back. Um, I'm not going to show you too much because um, just click the link in the video or description below and I have a whole nother video just about this book and how cool it is. So go check that out. Um, I hope you'll give the Drawing Honor a try with your Pathfinder Club. Um, try using these online resources. Trust me, you don't have to know anything about drawing. It'll work out just fine. Um, if you give it a try, leave me a comment and let me know how it went. And as always, stay Pathfinder strong. Mm -hmm.